Welcome back. It's still entertainment review live on Metro Television. So we have Ghanaian hip hop artist Quincy Arthur. Aye. Who is promoting his latest project title? This is not the tape three. And I mean, this gentleman hasn't been sleeping. He's given us something amazing. It's a night track project. It has two features, one with IDK and also Joy B. And the songs on it, I'm loving track number four. Do you know track number four? I'm loving mid. Made, made away, or make a way. Make a way. That's the make last track. Way. That's the last ah, track. I love that one. I'm talking about track number four. Be, I know what I'm a pair. Make a way. Oh yeah, it's okay. We are coming to talk to the man. I'm wondering if he has slept, cause he's been moving from place to place after the the project dropped. Cause he Aquaba. Yeah, yeah. Have yeah. you slept? Oh, I've been able to squeeze in a nap. Okay. Like, a couple minutes ago, so yeah, yeah. so yeah, cool. we still get the energy to go. Yeah. In. When you yeah. were coming, what track were you listening to? When I was coming, when yeah. I was coming, I was in silence. I was in like in the car. Yeah, they didn't play any song. Nah, I wasn't playing. Who was it? Who was driving? I was driving. Oh, and you didn't play any song. Nah. Why? Oh, I just wanted to be in silence. You oh, know? okay, yeah. okay. Cause I, you know, like I for psych my body, I did, you know. Oh, this will be yeah. home, though. This is home. Oh it's yeah, I know it's home. Time. I know it's home, but you know I've been around a lot. Yeah, you know, okay. so. I, I get it. I get it. Yeah. I mean, a, a, a year ago you were here. You were there with us. We had a very interesting conversation. Uh, positive reviews on YouTube. I think it's yeah, one of our like, biggest. Yeah, you had like a lot of reviews yes, on YouTube. Oh, on yeah. YouTube, yes. And you've had a look makeover. What informed that? Because anyway, here it was. Oh, for me, look makeover. Oh, a radier. <laughs> I get it. I get it. <laughs> a radier. That's I one. I'll, I'll just hold it. Anyway, no, it's okay. No, I'm a cause I think we're community. But when you were here, you had the the whole look we knew Chrissy Arthur for. Yeah. But now he's looking different. Yes. And so I'm. That's what I'm asking. What informed or inspired, influenced the yeah. new makeover? Um, so for the longest time, I've had the dreads, mm -hmm. you know. Um, I had it when I was pretty young, mm -hmm. you know. And yeah, like, as time has gone by, I was like, yo, Charlie, make I just try something new, you know. Yeah, yeah. I hadn't felt my scalp in a long time, oh. you know. Yeah, so I was mm -hmm. like, yo, let me just cut it for mm -hmm. something new. Yeah. Yes. Was it, was it something like you had been thinking about for a very long time? So you just woke up and like, uh, let me just I'm taking it out. Yeah, like it had been something I like I thought about for a long time, okay. you know. But I just felt like the time wasn't right mm -hmm. to do it, you know. But yeah, like me too. I be somebody where when I feel like doing something, like it's sometimes it go in my head. Uh, I go contemplate, but yeah, at one point it just happens, and I'm like, yo, let me do it. it, yeah, and just yeah. get it over with. It, it really looks like you you have you are really looking different. Like I won't lie, there's growth. There is some kind of uh, natural... Calm, like, I do feel calmness. Being yeah, calm. like, there's this natural sprout. Ah, like, it's like a whole new, new fresh air around you. What, what, I don't so know. It's not that, It's not that, it's, <laughs> not that. it's not that, it's not that. No, but the crazy we know is, it's like, but now it's different. Like, I can see that there's growth. Am I lying or I'm just deceiving myself? Um, I think I've always been kind of calm, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah, I've always been kind of calm. And I understand where you're coming from mm -hmm. in terms of the look, because mm -hmm. I had the hair and mm -hmm. I cut it, you know. Yeah. But yeah, this has been me, and yeah, I've you know, as time to go on, you know, yeah. man for grow, That's, learn new things, yeah. yeah. So maybe like that has also played a part in that. Yeah, but but let me come back. Let me come to music wise. What are you doing differently now in terms of music that years ago you were not doing? What am I doing now? Differently now. Differently yeah. now. I'm experiencing new things and mm -hmm. putting it. Like, and creating from a whole new perspective, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. And I was, I was fortunate enough to, you know, like I've been fortunate enough to like travel and like lock in with different people, mm -hmm. you know, like with this new project, I had the honor of like working in a whole new environment mm -hmm. and okay. yeah, yeah. working with people who are from like different mm -hmm. environments compared to what I've been used mm -hmm. to, you know. Yeah. Like most of these songs were recorded in America, mm -hmm. you know. Um, I had to lock in with Nectunes. Um, yeah. I locked in with an OG producer, mm -hmm. Troy Taylor, mm -hmm. and okay. Inigo Sain, who are from Inigo America Sain. as yeah. well. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think that's that's what's different about it. Yeah. And let, let me do this. As far as music is concerned, let's say mentally, physically, emotionally, um, how have you been? 
are you in a better space now in terms of as far as music is concerned? Yeah. Um, I would say I'm in a good place. I'm thankful for how far I've come. Mm -hmm. Um, I just dropped a project today. Yeah. You know, it's yeah. very exciting, like a nine song project, mm -hmm. you know, and yeah, I'm on to new things. You know, this is not the tape. This is, this is not the tape people have been used to it was a project where I'll put like three to four songs yeah, on there. Yeah, yeah. 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 But now I did do something different. Even yeah. how I, how we rolled it out. Mm -hmm. Like we had our fans have early access to the project. Yes. Yeah. You know, which is something that I'm, is totally different new to yeah. our, yeah. to our like, like market your fans, here. Yes. Yeah. You know, so I'm, I'm glad I'm in a position where I can try new mm -hmm. things, mm -hmm. you know, and I just experiment. Mm -hmm. And how is that experiment? Like asking your fans to actually pay for that, even though yeah. I said some, some, some were feeling like, yeah, no, they don't want that. to yeah. Charlie. <laughs> We don't have money since like I could see that. But then how was that experiment successful? Oh yeah, I would say I'll say it was successful. Mm -hmm. Like cause our intention was to give the people who have been like who are truly dedicated mm -hmm. to my craft like mm -hmm. an opportunity to experience something before everyone else does. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, and I think that we had the we were able to make that happen, mm -hmm. you know. And yeah, we learned some things along the way as well. Be like some like we had like quite a number of people yeah. mm -hmm. like an encouraging number of people purchase it and you know like interact with the project okay you know but yeah like it's giving us information and moving forward mm -hmm. um we're hoping to use this information to help us in like with our next coming yeah. project mm -hmm. was this the longest period you moved out of Accra I think you traveling because you've been yeah. going in and out, in and, out yeah. and even I thought you were even there for like a year yeah but I've been seeing that you. Come and go, you like go low key, low key. You come and go. Yeah. What, was that the first time, like you actually left Ghana to go somewhere into a new environment? How was the reception like, and how, how were people treating you? And what are some of the experiences you got from there? If you love to share with yeah. us. Well, the thing we say usually, like, I did go out of Ghana. Mm -hmm. You know, it just happens that this time, um, for some reason, it was like really publicized. Mm -hmm. You know, I remember like. Sometimes I'll just, I'll go to London and spend like two months, mm -hmm. three months. Nobody like I'll go that. to America, I'll spend a month, mm -hmm. you know, and, and like still come back. The one I did the up. You see? The one I did the seat up. <laughs> For the video inside. Was it? Was it? Oh, was a video. Oh, yeah, that'd be Mexico. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that was oh, in yeah. Mexico. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I went there for some time too. Yeah. You know, so it'd be something like I try to do. You know, mm -hmm. me, I'm from Tema. Mm -hmm. but we, mm -hmm. where we're from, we aren't open to a lot of experiences, okay. you know, it'd be limited. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I like to travel as well. But, yeah, this time, for some reason, it was really publicized. Mm -hmm. that, yo, I go, some people say, I go find a job where mm -hmm. they, I they work for there. I don't want to come back to Ghana. Yes. You know, which be, like, really ridiculous. Yeah. You know, because okay. in this space, like, you for travel. Yeah. Like, you yeah, for, go, you for yeah. go other yeah. places, yeah. you for work yeah. with new people yeah. and things. Yeah. yeah. You know, so <laughs> I don't know. Like, I don't know where they're coming from with that. Like, anyway. I think they were just missing you. They were just missing you. Yeah. Because yeah. at a point in time, I could see on Twitter, like, where is Chrissy Atta? Because you don't go yeah. into by the trend. <laughs> like, have you, have oh, you yeah. been on social media? Have you oh, seen yeah. Oh, I did see him. I did see him. Yeah, where people were like, oh, come back, come back. You see, I'm about, some of them, like, move around me, scan now. Like, <laughs> what's up? Are they here now? So, what's up? Make us. When, when, we said that Christine would be one of those people who is, when it comes to social media love, and if we give you love, uh, then when it comes to social media, the other it side too. Tend. If we give you a, uh, like, proper bashing, you know, it, it happens in, in that way. And whilst you were away, were you following what was happening, like, on these platforms? Oh, sometimes I see it. You know, sometimes I see it. And I'm in a place where I feel like I'm indifferent to mm. such, you know. Like, I try not to, like, internalize mm -hmm. internalize it, you know. Because, yeah, like, it'd be some way. One day you're loved, the next minute you're hated, you know. Yeah, so, so it is. So I try not to really internalize it. And, yeah, I make music out of love. Mm -hmm. And the people who they gravitate towards the music, like, yeah, yeah them be the ones that they do it for. Talking yeah. about being loved one day and then the other. the other. I was sharing with her and some of the team, the last time we came in and they were seated there and that interview, that bit that I cut, a lot of people took that, took that side. Thing, you know. you know, even though we said a lot of positive things. Oh, but that like, part there, you know, say that what they're going to talk about, yeah. that in this space, there are vultures and yeah. Are, hyenas. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. Say, yeah. yeah, you sign yeah, yeah, bad yeah, yeah. deals. Like two years ago. Oh, it's like, yeah. yeah. You said, you said yeah. that, yeah. With respect to that, yeah. 
and everything. I mean, I'm not going to act like, yeah, we don't know what happened. But everything that that's happened with your previous team, yeah. and even with your team members at Kanko, where Twitch um, wrote a couple of things on socials, and they were back and forth on yeah. there. Yeah. Like, what's the lesson? Big one. You know that the what is it then day, but now it it really touched you, touched people close to you. What was the lesson in there? Um, so like you just you just for be vigilant, you know, mm -hmm. and yeah, like just know what you are getting yourself into, mm -hmm. you know, before like yeah you put pen on paper or anything, you know, and yeah, like it's quite unfortunate that like it has to come to this way where like. We go online and, you know, make grievances head and all of that, you know. But I think it's a lesson to um, other artists as well, you know. Whatever you go into, like, mm -hmm. yeah, make sure, like, you are thorough mm -hmm. on your part about everything, you mm -hmm. know, before you venture into Going something, into that, yeah. you know, and, yeah. And starting from a community um, that gave you that community support yeah. and then it transcended into, like, a nationwide support. I say everybody loves Kusiath and everything. Fast forward, the experiences that you went through in the couple of, like, three, four years, did you, did you foresee that it will get to a time I'm going to go through that? With, irrespective of the fact that um, you're an artist, you anticipate yeah, challenges yeah. and then you say, I'll overcome. But your, yours was so beautiful from a community where they are supporting you. Yeah. It gets into, like, a nationwide phenomenon. Everybody's like, Kwesiatha, Kwesiatha. And then fast forward, something is happening. Did you foresee that, that it could happen to you and your career as well? Um, yeah, I think on a song I made Colors mm -hmm. on my second, yeah. on Life from Inkuma Kong yeah. Volume 2, I said something about that. Because yes. um, I've seen people who have come into the limelight and like at one point everybody hails them mm -hmm. and then after some time, yeah. you know, people start bashing them. So it's always something that's been at the back mm -hmm. of my mind. You mm -hmm. know, Bob, like they root for you till yeah. you become like, the, you become what they were rooting yeah. for, and like all of all of a sudden, you know, people start throwing stone. You know, it's like yeah. all kings get their heads mm -hmm. cut off in mm -hmm. a way. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. so yeah, I was always mindful of that, and like I knew, yeah, that would come at some point. But um, I think it's always been about it's always been about the music for me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, and like yeah, I know it's about the music, and I have to keep giving the people who are mm -hmm. dedicated to. Mm -hmm what we do like because yeah. they make me who i am like exactly. just give them more music and try not to as i said earlier internalize the love then they hate yeah you know yeah. Then then more, all yeah. i think the more you talk about it they just yeah you, talk, they're gonna feed on it oh, feed on it and leave the ones yeah. that yeah. you really like yeah, promoting yeah. them uh, like a whole and the thing now. is like it, social media too it'd be like sometimes people hide behind profiles oh, and stuff to do one, all sorts yeah. of things you know, yeah. so sometimes you can't really, like, trust certain things on there, you yeah. know. When I meet, the thing is, like, every time I meet people in person, like, it's never like that, mm -mm. you know. It's always love when I meet people. So I think, like, usually people are, people tweet and say mm -hmm. certain things from a point of, like, trying to have more engagement as yeah. well, you know. So that to be something. But every time I meet people, like, mm -hmm. it's always love. Uh, did, like, I don't even know how to say the, this. The question I get for might be like you, they can't, you ask out. Which one? Who you you ask out. I'm one to, talking about like social media and experiences and everything. Uh, you really got triggered after the whole David um, event at Atlant uh, yeah. Atlanta. And you, we could see, we, we were here and we spoke about the fact that artists are also human beings. Sometimes yeah. they get to a point, they are, like they are human beings. That's what people don't tend to remember. It gets to a point we are, we can be frustrated that, that when you saw the tweet and how people were just reacting and everything where you said I see yeah all comments yeah. Uh, even if there were two people in the arena I would still have performed I I would need yeah all to shove uh 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 yeah like how far did it trigger you like what what was the mood yeah. that you were in because. You see, the day you were here, I asked you, my first question was, how do you see life? And yeah. you were like, that's like a deep question. And you, you were able to explain yourself. Sometimes, I want the, the, the fans, the viewers, yeah. to also understand that the person that we are bashing on Twitter, the person that we are doing this to, it could be my brother, it yeah, could be my human, sister. You know. So sometimes, when I'm asking these questions, I want you to be legit. Yeah. How pissed were you? How triggered were you when you, when you really went 
or make me right. on us. Yeah. Yeah. Or clearly, shove it as. <laughs> I was, I was clearly, I was annoyed. You did, but where you did, but because. You you know they there, mm -hmm. you know, you they Ghana. You mm -hmm. don't actually see what they're going. Like you just mm -hmm. see a video from someone's yeah. like from a short point mm -hmm. of view mm -hmm. and you just they talk about Everything it. You know, like yeah. Like and it was it was a really great opportunity for mm -hmm. me. Being at the State Farm Arena and you know, opening for like the yeah. video. Yeah, it was a big you know, deal. Yeah. Exactly. So it it just it's annoying that like you they put effort into something yeah. like, oh yeah, yeah, then yeah, and they are the same people who will start where is Christiana, where is Christiana, and you when you show me? up, they just write anything yeah, that yeah, they yeah. want to. Yeah. But anyway, sometimes I feel it. like it be it be agenda too. Yeah. You know what I notice? Be say like a lot of like it's all about engagement. Yeah. You know, people say they say certain mm -hmm. things for engagement. Mm -hmm. You yeah. know, but yeah, in that state, I was annoyed, so I had to, that, you know, that's just fight what back. familiar things. Yeah. Agenda, agenda boys, Twitter, as agenda 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 boys yeah, are on Twitter. Yeah, so anything they are just say. But how long did it how long did it take you to plan and create this new project? Um it took it took a couple of months. Um some of the, I think some of the oldest song on there is from like twenty twenty two. Okay. Where DJ crept mm. Raging Bull. Okay. Yeah, and it's funny how that song came about. DJ Crept sent me a video. On I th Instagram, yeah, I, I think I said Snapchat somewhere, but it was mm -hmm. actually Instagram. Okay. He sent me a short video of him, like of the beat, mm -hmm. you know, and I was like, yo, Charlie, hold on, I did come to the studio right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, where I entered it, and it just flowed, just like, for me. And, yeah, I made that amazing record with DJ Crept. And, yeah, so some of the songs are from, like, 2022. And wow. when I decided to do this project... Um, you know, as I said earlier, I was trying to give my fans like mm -hmm. a lot more mm -hmm. than they mm -hmm. are used to, you know. Mm -hmm. So that'd be one of the records where I was like, yo, make me put you this on there. Yeah, you know when you dropped for life, people were saying that you were kind of switching to um, a piano or other sounds that are being loved by people. Yeah. But then this whole body of work comes and it shows us that this is the Kwisiasa that we knew and it's the same person, just that there's much more experience, there's much more diversity yeah. in terms of like the project and everything. And it makes it so, so beautiful. People will say that uh, this couldn't be the best timing for it. But then let me ask you, what made this that perfect timing to say that I want to do I this, I want to drop that. this whole Night Track project for my fans to just love and enjoy? Yeah, I feel like it's time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's time. It's been, it's been long overdue. Yeah. yeah, it's time. And in terms of um, me doing... Um, I'm a piano inspired songs. Yeah. Um, I'm a fan of music. Yeah. You know, I that's the first place I come from. Like, I'm a fan of music, and when I'm inspired by something, like, and I feel like creating it, I'd always like try my hands at it and like create it. You know, people who have been following me from the start know. Say, I be somebody like I did rap, mm -hmm. I did sing. You know, mm -hmm. like I. I'm truly like versatile yeah. with versatile. what I do. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and yeah, I'm I'm always happy and like I'm always happy to explore yeah. new things and, and to take my crafts places I've never yeah. done so before. Okay. And with this new project, you are collaborating with TV Music in terms of distribution and everything. How did this partnership come about? Um, so Frank saw how I Frank saw the artist uh, consumer yeah. idea we initiated and yeah he reached out to us and we think TMA is in the like has been on the forefront of mm -hmm. Ghana music for a while you know like it's been working with a lot of artists from over here so yeah. end up it, like the partnership made sense mm -hmm. so we were like yeah let's come together and make this work you know it's a budding Ghanaian company yeah. you yeah. know so yeah we have to come together on this partnership and put this project out okay yeah. uh, Good. this new project um mm -hmm. As you said, you know, it's different because you didn't even work on this, the records. Most of it was outside, outside the country. And now you have one before you, you go back in. Yeah. What is the message to your fans and people who keep saying that, why is crazy? I can't crazy. I am, you know, yeah. you know, you know, you feel like there's pressure. And so you guys take this and go and listen. And pair. Do you go through the numbers like you people really did listen to the tape? Oh yeah, like people, people they engage with it. Okay. Yeah, people they engage with it, and yeah, Charlie, 
to my the people who love my music, to my fans, you know, like you be the people I do it for, you know, like you inspire me a lot. And like I'm grateful you guys have taken me on and like they support my music. Yeah. You know, yeah, and like yeah, we always go give you, you know, like it never go stop. Yeah. You know why we started the show and we were playing um Grand Day remakes? Yeah. Because he turned on what you did tell and said, Wow. <laughs> Oh, I just like it's it's been a while. Yeah, you know, it's been a long time. Okay. Yeah. You know, we will open the phone lines for your fans, viewers, to get interactive yeah. with us. Uh, Kusiata is here uh, promoting his new project, and I mean, we all love Kusi, and we appreciate the fact that he's here to talk about this whole project. So you will be given the opportunity to call in. The numbers will be on your screen. It's, it's already on the screen. Okay. Just call us, be interactive with us, and a whole lot of things. But Kusi. We've been doing something amazing on this table. We are going back to hit songs that were released from the 2000s. And like you can see, like how we branded the studio, your back, yeah. we have legends there. And we've been speaking to uh, music experts, music lovers, people who started this whole journey in terms of how the evolution of music has been in Ghana. What's your take on it? How we have, we have gone through the mill. We have transcended from the likes of High Life. We got to hip hop. We came to Azonto, we came to a whole lot of things. From then to now, how do yeah. you see the industry and how has the transition been? Has it been positive? Has it been negative? Or we are still kind of in between somewhere? Um, I, I would say it's been quite a trip, mm -hmm. you know, because from young, like, I've been a fan of music, mm -hmm. like, listening to the radio a lot from the days of when, like, Obra for them, they play on the radio, Lord mm -hmm. Kenya, Konti Hene, mm -hmm. Book Back, mm -hmm. you know. Like I've been tapped in. Rest in peace, Castro. You know, I've been okay. <laughs> Yeah, I've been tapped in for okay. for so long. Okay. You know? Okay, there's a caller. Someone from Quill. Good afternoon. Hey, good afternoon. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. You? Yeah. I mean, we, we have Kwesi Asa here. <laughs> Anything you want to say to Kwesi? Yeah, I want to tell Kwesi that but he's doing very great. Kwesi is doing very great. And I really like him a lot. Yeah. Just, Love, bro. Just forget yeah. about the bad bike. Yeah, just okay. forget about it. <laughs> you know, love which which of Kwesi songs do you love? You love a lot. Yes, you be a Mesa with that song. Yeah, you be a Mesa with Mesa was MP. Hey, Kofi Mule. 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 Oh, okay. Mule. That's your favorite, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mule. 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 yeah. And uh, you know, he, he has a new project out. Yeah, you know, I just got to know. I just got to know. You just got to know. Please go and download the whole project and listen to it. It's an amazing project, yes. I hope you yeah. fall in love with track number four. I keep saying track yeah, number yeah, four. Yeah, yeah. But anyways, thank you very much for calling, okay? Bye. Uh, this track number yeah. four. Yes. Track number, Regible. track last one, make, make your way. Okay. It's, it's how was it? You know, let me talk about how was the whole, you see, it, it sounds different. I was listening to it with my pods and I get the whole wavy stuff. The whole beat comes into the left, the, like the left side, yeah, goes to the yeah. right side. The whole, yeah, it's like, when you listen to it with a pod or a JBL, yeah. because you know what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah, the sound yeah, yeah. is like wavy, it's synchronized. Very, very wavy. Oh, Charlie. Yeah, 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 very wavy. Uh, <laughs> we'll you know what? We'll Let's, I'll continue that. There's another caller. Good afternoon. Your name and where you're calling us from. I'm Prince Anna Chukor from Kumasi. Hey, from we, we, don't, we don't hear you. Prince from I'm Prince Anna Chukor from Kumasi. Okay, yeah. great. hey Prince, I say what's up? I did. Aye, so we've got Kwesi here. What you've got to say to him? Oh, I have had a full Kwesi in five. I had a full amp. Uh, I'm one of his biggest fans. I had a full amp. Uh. Hey, and then to you back where? <laughs> uh, this was his favorite song. Uh, talk too much. Talk too much. Me not like them. That song. Hi, hi, hi. Oh, anthem. I had a full that. I had a full that. I had a full that song. Okay, all right. Uh, big up, big up to Kwesi Ata. Big yeah. up yourself, Charlie. Yeah, go ahead, let's say, go ahead, stream the new project. No problem. Yeah. Go, go and sit down. Yeah. Go and sit down. Yeah. Bless up. Okay. Which one was your favorite? Or uh, which is your favorite or was like the vibe for you amongst the nine? Bro, Charlie, this be tough. I did, I really like Raging Bull as well. Oh. Yeah. And, and I like Make A Way too. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. Yeah. I like um okay, I like one of one. One of one, yeah. The first yeah, track. I like yeah. one of one. And you actually said there's uh, everything for there's enough for everyone. I think the first line you said there's 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 an there's oh there's enough for everyone or something like that. Like on the on the track. Everyone has something they'll have. Oh I no. Well, which one? The track number one, your yeah. first line. Your first line, first do you yeah. remember? I said, don't make it take a toll on you. Sick uh -huh. of it feels different. 
that's when he started rapping, but he said something interesting there. Okay, that's when you pick the call. I'm going to get Remember, remember, remember <laughs> that. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Hey, okay. What's your name, bro? Where are you calling us from? I'm calling from Accra, Abush. Okay. Okay. Well, see, he's here. Um, say something to him. Hey, brother. Hey, tell you can you hear me? Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> How far? A day, bro. Big up, big up. A day, bro. I already got the. I already got the. This one, the points on my phone, so no problem. Hey, I'm I got the Okay. All right. So, do you have any favorite of his? Like you can sing or rap to. You? I don't have much to say, but big up to you, okay? Uh, big hey, up yourself, hey. bro. Okay, great. Thank you for calling. Talking about the group, we see kind of Gen Z for now. Is that a great girl? Yeah, great girl and a girl. You know like that? Yeah, I hear that. It's a great girl. You know, hello. But, but how, how, working with Joey B, how, how is it? I mean, because after IDK, Joey is a person, the next person you see check yeah. on there. And and after uh, Raging Bull, Stone Boys voice or yes, the latter yes. end. Like, how, how was working with... Because Joey, too, hasn't been, like, uh, dropping back to back to back, but once in a while, he gives us something amazing. How was it? You called him that, oh, you have a project coming up. You want him to come on or... So, how it happened, like, Joey, Joey is, like, uh, like somebody we, you know, I did mess with a lot while, like, mm -hmm. Joey be really fire, mm -hmm. you know, and I recorded Raging Bulls at his studio. Okay. Oh. Yes, I recorded it at his studio, because... Crepes, they work from Joey yeah, B's yeah. spot. Mm -hmm. So I linked Crepes for there. Mm -hmm. And when I made the record, like, mm -hmm. there was a, I had done the first verse and the hook. You know, mm -hmm. there was no second verse or nothing. Okay. You know, and I think Joey had it and he liked the record. Wow. So he jumped on him way, like, I said, I'm yo, this be really fire. You know, and he also did like some additional production on the song as well. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, Krebs produced it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, shout out to Krebs too. Yeah. But Joey B added like some added additional some to it. Yeah. production to it. And yeah, he initiated the Stoneboy thing. Had Stoneboy. Yeah. So you actually asked Stoneboy to do that. Now, so Joey made that happen. Okay. Yeah, shout out to Joey B. Okay. I see that. You know? right, yeah, because he's part of like the whole production oh. of the song. Yeah, let's so get big up, big up, Joey. Yo, the ladies, you know, go call. Oh, hey. yeah, oh, ladies. <laughs> hmm. Okay, let's see who is on the line. Hello, good afternoon. Hello. Hello. Okay, so Man. oh you're there. Okay, what's Yo. your name? Yo, yeah. Where are you day? You day busy place. Yeah, hello. Hey, hello? Yeah, hello. Yeah, can you hear me? Hey, brother, I don't know what you're doing though. I think we've lost him um, on there. Uh okay, Chris, let me ask about Kanko. So <laughs> um Kanko Worldwide, is it still as a day like you and the boys for a day together in, in that space? Yeah, it's a collective, you okay. know, it's a collective. And we dropped um, a song together some, like, yeah. a couple months ago. Up, yeah, yeah, a very fire oh. record. Yeah. A very fire high life record. Yeah. And, yeah, like, we, we have a lot of songs together. Okay. Yeah, so hopefully, like, in the future, like, we might roll some out. Yeah. You, you may choose to answer or not, but I've got to ask this. Is there a finality on the whole situation with your former um, people? Well, like, I would really like not to uh, talk okay, about to talk it right about now. It. Yeah. Okay, okay, great. I, yeah. I understand that perfectly. All right, so uh, call the ladies. Call 0245 That's the number. Call us right now. Uh, let's talk to Chris Yatha. And, of course, we are still on with our songs from back in the day. Uh, today we're doing 16 to... Yeah, 16, there's a call out on the 17, line. Right? Hello. Okay. Hello? Hello? Yeah, hello. Yeah, good afternoon. Your name and where you're calling us from? My name is Gordon. I'm calling from Chintampo. Okay. Chris is in the yeah. studio. Would you want to say something to Chris? Yeah, yes, yeah, please. Yeah. 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 We did do a neck and neck. Big up, big up, big up. No projects. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Yes, I have it projects on replay the whole day yeah. i've been listening to it yeah and i've been following his interviews as well yeah i was uh, on uh 
three three music yeah. and I'm with you here too. Oh, I'm fire. The we are supporting him all the way. That's Fantastic. Big up, big up yourself, yeah. Charlie. Fantastic. Big, yeah. big up Charlie. yourself. Yeah, that's good. The, the okay, I, I, I learned uh, on the three music TV station, he said he has a project um, that he wished to help up, up and uh, coming out. I, I don't know if there's a way we can reach out. Um, okay. A platform, a, a, an internet platform, social media okay. platform, we can reach out to, to uh, make submissions and see if we might be lucky in a way. Okay, all right. Um, sure. So, like, no, we know we know start yet, you know. We know begin, oh. like, to fully function like that yet, you know. I just dropped the project. And, yeah, for now, like, project, we try to yeah. focus on the project and, mm -hmm. like, push it out, you know. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, in the future, like, you go here for me, just, like, Stay tuned on my socials yeah. and yeah, you go hear information about well, that. Yes, in the future. I go to big ups to my man next tunes for, 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 for that wonderful production. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah, for any how you feel, there's a song. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. So I said, I'm not going to mention it. Anyway, see, um, so with, with the fans, when you're away, were they may, like DMing you? How do you deal with that? Um, Yeah, like, I they DM me all the time, you know. So you and yeah, me and some of them, they vibe. Okay. Yeah, me and some of my people vibe, you know. Okay. Yeah. Ladies fans and male fans, which are they like? Oh, I didn't mess with them all. Oh, wait, wait, yeah, wait. I didn't mess with them all. Yeah, but you, you, you be woman, so male fans and female fans, who you go? You know, that's a color. Your name and where? Yeah. <laughs> that's wrong. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh, the ladies are not. Hello. Good evening. Evening. Please, your name and where are color that's from? My name is Juan Levick. I'm from Kumasi. Oh, what? I say Chrome. Charlie, Kwesi yeah. is here. Would you love to say something to Kwesi Asa? Oh, hi. Hi, I can't tell Charlie. What's up? <laughs> yeah, Charlie, I, I do. I do, I do feel raw. It'd be so, Charlie. Love, bro. Which yeah, of Kwesi song do you your like? This song, your this song. Talk, talk of Ken out of five. Oh, yeah. okay. 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 Yeah, that'd be hard I make record. a little freestyle for you? Yes, yes. Go ahead. Coke, Coke, you know, be Pepsi. Your long shit, you not impress me. You don't compare, man, not confirm. Did you miss it my first week? More ashes, less speed. More ashes, less speed. Oh, cool, three block. No, yo, all my sons have been dead beat. Ah, right. Yo, big up, big up, okay. big up, big up. Okay. okay, all right, thank you very much. One lyric calling from Kumasi, though. Yeah. You know, I was going to say that um, for your young career, in, in that sense, you've been dropping, like, full tapes, 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 like, or oh, drop it, drop a single, so, but like from live from Inkuma Chrome 1 yeah. to 2 to This Is Not The Tape. Like other artists, they drop singles, singles. Sing, then go there, one single. But you go there, you go drop like like a full project, like more than five songs, and not Son of Jacob. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Like all of these tapes. What's, what's the plan? Like how do you decide that? No, let me drop something like this, like a full project, or make I just flash in some single, make we just the move. How you do it? Um, it's, it's energy, you know, it'd be energy. Okay. And yeah, I feel like, you know, when the time is right, you know, I talk to the team, we all agree on like how to move and yeah, if the energy is right, the timing is right, we just put it out, you know, and I make it happen. Well, yeah, I'd be somebody to like, as a fan of music, like, I did like listen projects, mm -hmm. you know, so that's what I love giving as well, you know. Which yeah. other songs do your playlist up apart from Kwesi Atta? Because the way they talk, say, be fun of music, yeah. means like you still listen to other people's projects. Like top three songs where you listen apart from your, your sound. Oh, top three songs I listen to. I think The New Can Promise, I didn't mess with The New Can Promise, Paris. Paris. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I didn't mess with that song. Um, This is not the tape, sorry. This is not the tape three. Yeah. By Kwesi Atta. <laughs> yeah, that one too. I did blast that one. I like it was yeah. <laughs> Yeah. And Kitty, Kitty, get this new yeah, song, Danger. Danger. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think one. I did gravitate towards that. And I don't, Gona Boy. Mm -hmm. Gona Boy, okay. I believe. Oh. Yeah, okay. I believe. That'd be hard record. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. There, there's a caller. Hello. Hello. Hey. I'm calling from Tamale. 
Tamale, okay. Uh, what's the name? Uh, Abdel Fatal. Fatal. Quick, since yes. the building, say something to him. Hey, right, bro, You're bro, bro, don't no, listen to you. I say I'm on the TV. Love the volume and speak to me on the Hello? phone. Hello? Speak to me on the phone. Speak to me on the phone. Okay. I just want to say I like Osiata very much. Okay. Love, bro. Okay, okay. Yeah. What's your favorite song from him? Okay, it's going to take He's a while. Gone, anyway. Yeah. But see, how do you feel with the normal support? Like, no matter what, people still just love Kusiata, Kusiata. How does it feel? You, you, you go off for some time and then you still come back. And like you said, you are still in touch with your fans and your games and things. How does it feel? Oh, like, it's... I did feel honored, you know, and yeah, it'd be gifts. Like, I'm thankful. Yeah. I'm thankful for it, you know. I'm thankful for that. Yeah, and bro, like, I'm thankful I could features go and like drop music and mm -hmm. like, yeah, people, all, everybody will be gravitating towards it. Yeah. I noticed um, the project is now number one on Ghana, yes, Apple Music, yes, it is. you know, which is, which be very fire, you mm -hmm. know. So, shouts to everyone who has streamed the project. Mm -hmm. Keep streaming it, put your friends on. Yeah. And put down point repeats as well. Yeah, that's yeah. like the normal thing. If he drops, it's gonna be on like number one, uh, like for a minute. Yeah, you know? it'd be the fans, Charlie. Yeah. Make up yourself. Have you read your so comments? Much. Comments on YouTube. Oh yeah, you do. I like. Do I, I see it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But why do they laugh? Nothing. I'm asking because like I just open one or like over the brain comments. Yeah. Be you know like. It's like the fans, they wait to use so everybody, they can't comment, comments, yeah. they're like, okay. Hey, so the ladies cool. didn't call. That's the last caller. Uh, your name and where you're calling from. <laughs> hello? Um, hello? Hello? Yeah. Please, your name and where you're calling us from. Achu from Accra. Okay. Which side of Accra? Uh, what? What did you say? Osu, 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 Osu. Chale Kwesi is here. Anything for Kwesi? Okay. Hey, you are listening to yourself. Hello? Yeah, I can hear you. Can you just mute your television? I'm going to tell you what I'm saying. I'm going to say. Yeah, big up to Kwesiata. Big up yourself, Chale. Yeah. Okay. All right. Anyway, yeah. anyway, we the cannot ladies. hear ourselves from your television. The ladies, is, I'm surprised the ladies didn't call. Hey, hey. people, it's crazy at all. This is crazy for the streets. Like, <laughs> so like the boys, the boys so in the call. I represent the ladies. You represent yes, the ladies. Represent the ladies. Anyway, Chrissy, yeah. um, we're happy you're back in here. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, what am I? Someone? No. Oh. Hello. Oh, Hello? there's a lady. Hello. Hi. Oh, Hello. You? Hello, please, your name. I'm Deborah calling from Kofodia. Deborah, Deborah calling from, from Kofodia. Okay. Debbie, Debbie do, you, do you listen to Kosiata's music? Yeah, I 